Hey guys, it's Faith and welcome back to another video on the channel. The thing about me is I love fall and winter fashion. I might not like the weather, but I love the fashion. I feel like I get the most dressed up in this time of year. So in today's video, I wanted to share with you some of my favorite pieces that I'm wearing or have been wanting to wear for the fall and winter season, as well as three outfit ideas slash outfits that I'm planning on wearing throughout the fall and winter season. Everything that I mentioned will be linked down below some of the stuff is like discontinued or I just can't find online so I'm sorry in advance but everything else will be linked below so with that I hope you guys enjoy it and without further ado let's get right on into it okay so I want to talk about some of the pieces that I have been loving or just like anxiously excited to wear for the upcoming season so number one sweaters the thing about me is I own way more sweaters than any other clothing piece that I own. Sweaters is just like my favorite thing. I'm wearing one right now. A couple of these outfits have sweaters in them. But the thing I struggle with is I always pick up cream colored sweaters every time I go shopping and I have to stop myself because I'm like, Faith, you already have like six or seven cream sweaters. You need to chill. I've been trying to get more creative with the different color sweaters I wear. I just bought this purple sweater from H&M. I'm obsessed. I love the sleeves. I love the fact that it's a turtleneck. Love me a good turtleneck sweater. So I'm so excited to be wearing it in multiple outfits throughout the fall and winter. Okay, another type of piece I'm really excited for for the season is statement jackets. Now, I feel like in the last year or so, I've been investing in more statement type of jackets. Like last year, I was definitely in my black leather jacket era, and I definitely see that coming back. I also bought various jackets and just like statement jackets overall because my style is honestly so simple and so neutral when I throw a jacket on top of it I feel like it's a whole new outfit so that's my tip if you dress very neutral or you're just trying to minimize your wardrobe definitely get a couple statement jackets because it's going to change the entire vibe of your outfit I have two favorite jackets that I'm wearing right now one of them is my black denim jacket I have been holding back on wearing this in every single outfit because I just love it so much. I love that the denim jacket is just oversized. It fits really well. It looks really nice and it just kind of gives that casual feel. Another statement jacket I've been loving is my pink jacket from Misguided. I get a lot of compliments on this jacket and it's so sad because Misguided is like no longer selling in the United States which is so sad but I love wearing this jacket. It has like that kind of like scratchy feel. So I always wear something long sleeve underneath, but it just looks so cute. I love pairing it with jeans, or in this case, I paired it with some pleather pants, which we will get into when we show the outfits. I am so excited to be wearing hats and scarves, especially in the weather that we're in right now. You guys, it's like 40 degrees during the day and it dips down to like lower 30s high 20s so i am just so excited to be wearing the scarves and the hats again fun fact like in the seventh eighth grade i used to wear infinity scarves with every single outfit like that's kind of what i was known for in school at the time was my infinity scarf and my t-shirt with jeans and then like tennis shoes or uggs like that was my uniform but i am switching it up i am dishing the infinity scarves and i'm going to be wearing this really gorgeous scarf i actually found at target recently it's like humongous it's so warm it's light gray and it has like that braided fringe at the bottom I'm obsessed. I've also have been gathering some Pinterest inspo for other types of scarves, like more colorful ones. So maybe I'll buy some for the winter time, but I'm excited to be wearing my scarves again. But I also have this cream hat that's actually my mom's that I low key stole. I love just wearing a hat, especially like going out for a walk. Like I gotta keep my head warm. So maybe I'll be buying some more different types of hats in the winter time. I honestly have never been the beanie girl like i had a beanie in the past but i kind of regret it low-key so i feel like i'm just gonna stick with this one hat for the winter time which is fine right okay next is boots obviously the ugg boots are so crazy in right now they're always in every year but i feel like this year the hype has heightened so i have my go-to chestnut ugg boots that i've had for years and years and years and they're still really comfy and they're still like in style which I love so I obviously love pairing it with a good pair of leggings like that is just like 
the go-to move for the fall. So I love wearing my Uggs anytime I can. I also love wearing my black boots. I got these, I think, last year or the year before. I believe I got them at Target, so very affordable. So those are the two boots that I'm rocking with this year. And the last thing I'm really excited for are these pleather pants I got at H&M. I'm definitely gonna be making a future TikTok or reel about how I'm gonna be styling these pleather pants. It definitely takes me out of my comfort zone because I'm, again, like very casual, basic style. And it's just kind of like give it a step up. So that's specifically one piece I'm really excited to, you know, style in the fall time, maybe the winter, but I'm kind of seeing like more fall time just because I feel like it'll go well with like a sweater. Like I feel like that would just be like the go-to outfit from now on is like the pleather pants and then just like a chunky sweater. Okay, so now that I talked about the pieces that I'm excited to be wearing, I thought I would put these pieces together into a few different outfits. So outfit number one, I'm really excited about. I actually wore this yesterday and it was so warm. I was outside, it was windy, it was cold and the scarf kept me warm. I just love me a good all black outfit. Like I felt like last year that was the move. We're gonna carry it on this year. So with the black turtleneck and leggings, I put a denim jacket over it and then obviously the scarf, but I didn't like wrap it around my neck. I honestly just like put it around my neck and that was it. So all you really saw was the jacket and the scarf. You didn't see the turtleneck or the leggings really. Obviously I had to pay homage to my cream sweater collection. So this is one of my favorite cream sweaters right now. It's like your go-to knitted cream scarf. Like that, it's the kind of sweater that you wear on Thanksgiving. So I actually got this from Target and then I paired it with the black leather pants. I cannot wait to wear this outfit out. I want to say like maybe to church or to like a dinner or something. It would look really cute and then I thought I would pair it well. I have some cream converse that would look really cool so it would tie in with the sweater. But if I wanted to be extra warm I paired it with this jacket. Now this is more for like winter time when things get extra super cold because this sweater is already super warm already. I would pair it with this jacket. Typically I would wear this with like my go-to like Levi denim jeans, 501 skinnies, but this looks so good with the leather pants. I feel like I could pair any like chunky sweater with these pants, but the jacket just takes it up a notch. Okay, and the last outfit I have in mind, again, a good old sweater with jeans. I had to like shout out my Levi jeans because I literally wear them all the time. So I'm wearing the Levi 501 skinny jeans. I love the cut at the bottom, how it's like frayed at the bottom and I just love the way these jeans fit. So right now they are my go-to jeans and then that purple top I thought would look so cute with the jeans. Also, it would look really cute with the pleather pants as well. But for the sake of switching things up, I just paired it with the jeans. I haven't worn these in a minute, but they're like these tall knee-high boots. I feel like it's like the color palette is still neutral and still light enough for this outfit. So I feel like we should try these on and see how we feel about these. What do we think? Is this too like farmhouse vibes? Let me know down in the comments below because I don't have a mirror <laughs> right here. It's giving kind of like southern vibes too because of like the big sleeves, the boots, and the Levi jeans, you know? Like, this is closest to yeehaw I'm gonna get. So with that, I hope you guys enjoyed this little fashion inspo video. If you want more of these, let me know down in the comments below. Give this video a thumbs up. Also, I post on social media all the time, always on Instagram, so if you want to follow me on there, I'll link those down below, as well as all the other pieces that I mentioned in this video. But with that, I hope you guys have a wonderful day, and I'll see you guys in my next video really soon. Bye!